Hey, thanks for checking back in, everybody. There's been kind of a dramatic change when it comes to Hurricane Irma. Irma now suddenly is moving faster and is going to hit the United States. Now it looks like maybe a day, day and a half earlier than we thought. Possibly starting to feel effects as early as Saturday the 9th. And the track has changed a little bit. Let's go through this real quick. We'll play it ahead. And as you can see, it's just, wow. Here we go. We're into the 9th, all right? So here we are. This is 8 p.m. on the 9th. And you see you've got a serious storm on your hands coming right in to Florida. But the track has changed a little bit. Check this out. As we move ahead. Oh, by the way, this guy here may end up being a real big problem. We're going to move ahead. We're now on the 10th. You know, we weren't really expecting crap to happen till on the 11th. And now it appears as though the 10th is going to be when it's happening. And you're full on there on the 10th at 5 a.m. As it stands right now. Southern tip of Florida out into the Keys and stuff is going to be a problem. A big problem is coming in. And we're going to continue on. As you can see, this is a very, wow, 161, 164, 170, 170. Look at that. My God. That's crazy. Miami, 147. How hallelujah. Oh man. This is a this is every, every report it just seems to be getting worse to be honest with you. But let's get back on track here before we waste too much time. I'm gonna move it ahead. As you can see, it's hanging over it's gonna go over the eastern tip of Florida. See where we're talking about here. Looks like Orlando. Tampa is going to be feeling some stuff at this point. 75. Orlando, 104. And it just continues up. Still talking. See, she's, she's been hammered down a little bit, looks like, from landfall at that point. Oops. Sorry about that. It's like a psychedelic friggin' mind trip. Now we're into Jacksonville. 90. Okay, now this is on September 11th at 11 a.m. See, so look at this wide area. Look how wide this area that's being affected by this thing. There's New York City up there, by the way. So that gives you some idea. This guy is going to be a problem, I'm telling you right now. There are models that are actually showing this guy coming up, hovering here. This comes up, clears, and it basically sucks this guy right in. Hopefully that won't happen, but that's something you may see emerging. And here we are. Now it's back over water. It's had a chance to pick up a little bit of its speed. 2 p.m. on the 11th. Wow. Didn't look like it made that big a jump right there. Okay, yeah, it's still over water right there. 5 p.m. on the 11th. Right there. Now, this is 8 p.m. on the 11th. Again, Charlotte is now starting to look like it's going to be in the crosshairs. Whoa, sorry about that again. It got me a fidgety friggin' mouse, and I apologize for that, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, Fayetteville, Raleigh, Durham. Greensboro, even over here in Atlanta, might be seeing a little bit of gusty action. Let's see now, zoom out here a little bit. Okay, yep. Yeah. So here's Charlottesville. We're now on the twelfth. So we'll go through the rest of it here real quick. And you see now it's projected to head out this way. That's 
you got to check that out. There's a few few frames of that where the remnants start turning back towards the east. As you can see, it's still a fairly beefy little thing. There it is. Now this guy's sitting here, right? So the theory now is, or there are a few projections. I've yet to uh, get a copy yet, but I'm trying very hard to. Where this guy goes out and basically sucks this one right in, and it comes up for a double, double undercut right there. And uh, let's see. This particular model is not showing that. It's showing it and then eventually going back here. But check this out. Okay, this is on the 13th. Okay. I mean, you're talking serious winds here, you know? This is kind of crazy if you, if you think about it. This storm is just going to be, it may be coming fast, but it's going to frig with a lot of us. I just noticed that on the, uh, looks like New York City may be getting a little, little piece of it. Well, that's where it stands for now, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it looks like, it looks like the 10th could now be a bad day, the start of a bad week, actually, for the United States. Again, Florida is definitely in play. Now it looks again like the models are kind of going off to the east again. This is subject to change. And, uh. Hey, be good to each other. Prepare if you have to. Get good with God and we'll be back.